Hello YouTube, in this video I'll show you the features in the Oxygen OS update 3.5.2 which is also called Open Beta 3. If you go to settings menu, about 4, you can find I'm using Oxygen OS 3.5.2 for my OnePlus 3 which is based on Android version 6.0.1. So let's check out the features included in this one. First of all, I did kill all background processes button in recent menu. So if you click on uh, the recent options you can find this button if you click that one you will get two options one is normal clear so this will clear the task list and cache and then the deep clear which will remove the background process and everything so you can choose either this normal clear or deep clear i i prefer using normal clear because if i go for the deep clear sometimes even my music player forces to close so in this but that i don't want to do that so i'll go with the normal three option so that is one the next added long press option in messages application so if you go to messages here if you click on the messages you will get the extra features to choose from and then next one is enhanced incoming call notification ui so if someone is calling you the calling interface will be different and here is the added manual check for update in the settings menu if you go to settings menu system for update and then you can um, local upgrade and then manually check that upgrade and then added additional directions for first fingerprint configuration so when you configure for the first time it will ask for some extra options and then battery saver mode optimization and enhancement so if you go to settings menu battery click on the, this option you can see your battery optimization you can see all the applications has been optimized and then here you can see high power usage apps so you if you want to throttle down the high power use high power usage apps you can do that and then next one is added back contacts widget in launcher so if you click and go for the widget you can see the contacts here down below and improved dialer speed and then new modes added in control panel night mode and power saver so if you drop down and then click this edit you can see extra battery saver and the, the night mode option here if i want to swap with anything i can swap it and then save it so it's really good and also added support for the pin codes up to six digits so these are updates are changed and if you want to install this update manually using TWRP we'll provide a link in the description let's go and check it out that's it guys thanks for watching please subscribe for more